so for school today, and I worked on letter 12 and doing some math with 12s. And then we continued, we learned yesterday about caterpillars, so I just continued it. Um, this was actually from Edie's book, but um, I had a whole section about caterpillars, and this was a book just from their bookshelf in their room that we read. Good morning, it is Thursday morning. We actually are getting cl getting closer to uh, noon now, getting closer to the afternoon, and I am putting t lunch together. We've just had a really laid back morning. We did schooling as usual, all the usual things. I edited my video for tomorrow, and the kids have, all three of them have dentist appointments today at one o'clock. So we're doing a little bit of an earlier lunch so that they are not rushed and we have time to brush their teeth before we head out. And then when we get back, you know, I'll do nap time and quiet time and all that. But yeah, I haven't really done all that much today. I was able to get rid of that um, baby play set thing. I mean, I just put it for free and someone just came just five minutes ago and picked it up and took it and now it's gone. So that's good. I wasn't sure if I, I was debating bringing it to the swap, but uh, it's kind of heavy. So I would rather just, you know, have it gone before then. And someone coming to pick it up is ideal. I love Facebook Marketplace, use it all the time. It's the only reason I have Facebook. I would have been off of Facebook a long time ago, but you have to have an account to do Facebook Marketplace. So I've kept it. So for lunch, we're just having the rest of the chicken noodle soup, just trying to use it up. I guess I made a ton because it has lasted a while. And then I made grilled cheeses on these brioche buns. Uh, tomorrow is our grocery shopping day, so just trying to use up what we have. And honestly, I love these buns. They're so buttery and delicious, so I think it'll go really well with the soup. I'm actually really hungry. I realized I didn't eat breakfast today. I had my coffee and I was editing and we were just kind of doing the thing and I wasn't like super hungry. But now I'm pretty hungry, so I'm excited to sit down. In cattle, in silver, in gold, and Lot, I started to go upside down. <clears throat> and Lot, who traveled with him, was also very rich. All right, so we are back home from the dentist. It went really well. Um, you know, I wasn't quite sure how Luke was gonna do, but he honestly was, he did better than his other sister, <laughs> who was a little bit more nervous about it. Uh, but they, I really, really like the dentist that we go to. He just really knows how to, you know, make kids feel comfortable and like he doesn't push them and kind of just like takes their lead. And he like let me sit down on the chair with them. He always says like, I don't want their experience to be negative because then the next time, you know, they go into it with, you know, that like, trepidation. So he's just a really, really sweet guy. They were kind of bummed out because usually they give out like a little goodie bag with like toothbrushes and toothpaste and they're not doing that anymore. So they got stickers. So <laughs> they were kind of let down about that. But overall it was, very positive experience, and now we're back home. Luke fell asleep in the car on the way home, which was great, so I just put him down in his crib. He is napping. The girls just went into their room and started playing. I don't know, I hear them giggling about something. Um, and I just finished my video for tomorrow and scheduled it, and now I'm just kind of doing a little bit of wallpaper research. I kind of want to wallpaper the boys' room, it's only half the wall because they have like the decorative molding on the wall. So it would go pretty quick. It's just picking one <laughs> pattern that is difficult. And now that I have this new rug that has, you know, kind of like a pattern to it. And then you have like, you know, crib bedding and then Luke will have his bedding. And it's like trying to coordinate all the different patterns going on. It's hard to pick something. Like I want something that's just kind of pretty neutral, like not very busy as much as I love a lot of patterns that have like color and like animals or I don't know. There's too many different themes that you could go with. So it's probably futile at this point. I should probably wait and see what kind of like bedding I can wind up doing for Luke and like get his bed in there and see all that come together. Maybe I should wait and do that before I go picking any wallpaper, but it's just been, fun to look at. 
Um, but yeah, it's been a pretty low key day. I'm gonna switch laundry. I mean, I feel like I don't even need to say that. You know that that's happening <laughs> in my day. And then um, dinner is probably just gonna be a little bit of like a fridge clean out. Like I said, we're gonna do groceries tomorrow. So we have like some leftover pot rolls from last night and we have, I don't know, a couple other things that we could put together and just kind of use up what we have um, before I bother making something new. So I'm not quite sure what exactly I'm gonna make, but it's still it's still early. All right, fun. Mm. What do you have that's fun, Lara? Recess or drums? I'm gonna go with recess. Yeah. Is that you, Lara? Lively. Oh, I should have kept drums. Lively. Let's see. Yeah, drums would have been good for that. Yeah, do you have a hat on? Yes, I do. Mm, perfect. Bernard. Nope. Uh, you're Robert. I am Robert. All right, let me guess you. Are you a woman? Yes. Yes, you're Maria? Yes. <laughs> I got you. Is your husband on glasses? Glasses? No. What's his name? Er Eric. Eric. Yes, I am, Eric. All right, so I'm just throwing together a few different things that we had on hand for dinner. And the kids are watching a Wild Kratts episode that's about butterflies. So I thought that kind of tied in our lesson from yesterday and today. Um, but I had this bag of raviolis in the freezer the kids have been wanting to have. So we're gonna make that. And I warmed up some sauce, just jarred pasta sauce and I put in some fresh garlic and then we had leftover pot roast that I just warmed up and then the water was boiling for the raviolis but they only took like five minutes to cook so I have also broccoli in the oven so I want to wait for that to be closer to done before I put in the ravioli. All right so here's dinner very random but you know just using up what we have before we get more tomorrow. So it is actually the next day now. Last night after dinner, I just like sat on the couch. I like all of a sudden had a wave of exhaustion. And as I was laying there, I kind of was like feeling nauseous. So I went to bed at like 8 p.m. Or I went and took a hot shower, which always makes me feel a little bit better. Um, and then just got in bed really early. And Dan kind of, you know, held down the fort, which was wonderful. Um, I don't know what it was. It was just kind of, I felt totally fine all day, but like after dinner, I just, I mean, I don't know if it's because I sat down that I started to feel tired or, you know, I sat down because I was tired. I don't know, but I got in bed and I woke up feeling fine. So I don't know what that was, just kind of a, you know, a passing feeling. And now, you know, it's the next day. It's nice and sunny out and I'm feeling fine. So just wanted to close out the vlog from yesterday. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow or today. <laughs> okay. <laughs>